Hello, welcome everybody to the Cosplay Kid. So, in today's video, I'm going to be making stacks of dollar bills. Um, and I'm going to be showing you guys, well, not really showing you, but telling you how I made this. I'm kind of showing you as well. So, stay tuned if you want to know how I made this. Okay, so basically, what the first step is, is to get a real dollar bill, five dollar bill, ten dollar bill, twenty dollar bill, whatever else there is. Obviously I live in the UK so the reason I'm not doing pounds is because you can't photocopy them and our money is now plastic and so it just wouldn't look realistic enough. But anyway, um so what you want to do is just photocopy a dollar bill on each side. Now it does discolour it a little bit a little bit. Um I've left the other dollar bill upstairs i did try to do double sided but obviously it didn't match up so i just did one for each side um and so it is a diff different color to the actual dollar bill so it's pretty obvious that it's not if you compare it to a real one but if i just showed you that it, it looks realistic enough and it's got all the detail and everything so yeah so it's up to you if you want to tea dye this um I haven't on these ones, um, but I did on these ones. Um, and in my opinion, they don't look as good as tea dyed. It like stained it and made it green, um, just regular tea, and it just stained it and kind of smudged the green. So that's why I've chosen not to do it again. Um, I think I showed the difference between the two that's the difference so it's up to you which one you'd prefer but i prefer this one mainly because i think it looks more realistic but it's totally up to you like i said um so yeah that's the first step print two well you don't even have to do two you can just do one the front but i like to do the bottom as well next step is to get around 10 15 sheets of paper mark the sides of the dollar bill like the real one or even the print out one on the paper and then you just go literally cut them out in about 15 and i just i think i did about 15 at a time and just kept cutting them until i got a stack like this um and there's 98 pieces of paper here which is the exact amount what i did I is that. i boiled some tea in a bowl and literally took the stack of money and literally just put it in there swished it around for about a minute took it out and let it over, over air dry overnight that's what i was meant to say um and so you should get this now i know it probably looks like normal colored paper but i'll show you normal compared to it um, if i can so it is a slightly different color but you don't have to do that, but I just did that. Anyway, um, and then what you want to do is put the two dollar bills on each side. Um, which I'll do in a minute. And you're going to need a rubber band. I've got my trusty rubber band. God, I can't speak today. My trusty rubber band ball right here. So, I've got a rubber band. And... What I'm going to do is pretty simple. I'm going to grab one bill, put it on the top, put the other ball, bit. God, why can't I speak? The other bill on the other side, making sure they face the same way. Then you want to grab the rubber band, place it around it, then double. Double, double it and then basically just move it to the middle now you could get um money bands currency strips i think they're also called um but you can go to your bank and ask for them they probably will give them to you but i didn't bother i just do a simple elastic band and it does the trick now it's probably best to get like a beige one but i didn't have a beige one so that's what i got but it does look pretty pretty realistic and you know what would look cool if you had enough ink to print loads of these and to just flick through it and just have all of them 
but obviously I'm not going to waste that much ink just to flip through it. But to be honest, to be fair, that does look pretty real. And so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe um, and please like, turn the notification bell on, all that stuff. And yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.